buddy. How are you? Just trust you for joining me today on press day. Oh, oh nice to see you. We could say the and, same to you, buddy. Right. Animaniac season three premiering Friday, uh, February 17th on Hulu last season. How does that make you feel? Well, you know, it, it, we're happy that it had the opportunity to come back at all. We never counted on it. We never banked on it, you know, but when it did, we were happy that we were happier still that they did it at a high level like they did the original. And even now we've been talking about this all day. We're sort of viewing this as with a, with a little bit of skepticism because people, too many people love this thing for it to really go away. You know, so right. whether it comes back as a, a series again or a movie or some sort of other platform or whatever, I, I, I think we're going to be seeing the Warners wreaking havoc again sometime in the future. But, yeah, it was just a joy to work on it. Tress, what about you? Yeah, that's what we're hoping anyway. I mean, uh, uh, I, I don't like to uh, you know, put a button on this show sure. because it just doesn't seem real because we have. Uh, you know, gone away and come back and gone away and come back. And Rob, Jess and I and Mo uh, have uh, continued to uh, tour and uh, to to keep this franchise a lot, yep. kept this franchise alive for, well, right. you know, for 25 years, for the for the 20 years that were that we took a little time off. Right. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> yeah the, uh, you know, Rob was going out and uh, really promoting uh, the Animaniacs and, and Jess and I were uh, going out on tour uh, with Rob and Mo. And so um, it it's a very active thing for us. And so the fact that we're not going into the studio to record uh, additional lines is almost secondary because it's like, oh, no, here we are. And yeah, we're still here. <laughs> and we're coming to it. Right. And, we're, and we're coming to a town near you. Preferably, but, um, yeah. <laughs> so uh, I had the opportunity to watch uh, the first two episodes the other night. Uh, it's still you the same. Fa yeah, fast paced, lot, fast paced, lots of energy. What are you hoping for when the the original old school Animaniac fans and the new ones that are still tuning in? What are you hoping to get out of this season? Just some happiness, man. You know, it's like, uh, it, it sounds sort of cliche, but I wasn't aware when we did the first one that the world was really in need of a, a shot of positivity and a shot of fun. But I think it is now. <laughs> We've had, It's been a rough couple of years, folks, for, for the world at large. And, and if this show makes anybody's day a little bit better, even for the 22 minutes that it takes to watch it, then our work mm -hmm. is great. Tress, what about you? Yeah, man? yeah. Well, um, you know, amen to that, Jess. Um, I uh, what was the question? I was just, oh, you, I was just, I was, just, yeah. I was just taken off into a very pleasant place, <laughs> and he's sort of talking about these wonderful things. Twenty-two minutes of fun in a world oh, yeah. that, well, that really needed. But now you have to understand, Elias, that we haven't seen any of these shows. Yeah, we so haven't. you know, you 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 uh, know better than we do uh, um, just how fabulous they are. So how fabulous right. are they? <laughs> From um, what I've seen so far, they're great. Oh, cool. Well, that's right. good. We're, um, we're excited to check them out. Yeah, that. and you know, it, it the 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 flavor and the temper of uh, of the Animaniacs is uh, always the same, and that is it's good, it's good spirited, it's happy, it's you know, it's it's jovial, it's it's family, and you know, it's just a rocking good time. It's mm -hmm. singing with some and fun dancing. with some great music, singing, singing and dancing, right. Mary Lou. You got yeah. it. Yeah. If this is the last time we see you as these characters that you guys oh, voice, don't say you, it, don't what, say it. What are you gonna miss most about them? Uh, I'm just gonna miss the fun of working with people that I love on a show that I love and a character that I love dearly. You know, we've been very, very blessed that we have done a lot of these shows, not just Animaniacs, but a lot of cartoons and a lot of video yeah. games a lot of voices and a lot of things, and they all hold a place in our hearts. But I, I know for myself that this show and this character is at the top of my heap, man. And, and I mm -hmm. love that little guy. And I'm just, uh, I'm honored to have been a part of this legacy that is Animaniacs. Yeah. yeah. Tress, let's end this yeah. with you. What was the question again? I just <laughs> fall into, I just <laughs> fall into his, I fall into his. I said, if this is the last time we hear these characters, what are you going to miss the most about him? Well, Girl. like just said, of course, I will miss very much are being together in the recording studio because it's the most uh, fun you can have, you know, and uh, and uh, even though we will uh, see each other uh, in, in other places, it's sure. very special being in that room together and uh, working on something as fun and creative 
and successful and love as the Animaniacs yeah. and knowing that it's it's top notch uh, writing and production and music. Uh, and it, it's really uh, wonderful to be a part of that, you know, yeah, and uh, yeah, it, Animaniacs really sets itself apart from uh, most of the rest. Right. You know? Amazing. Amen. I want to thank you uh, for giving a few minutes today, February 17th, right around the corner on Hulu. Thank you. Thank Thanks you so much, Les. Thank you. Great talking to you. Thank you. See you at the water, Tala. That's right. <laughs>